I'm Melissa Benoist from Glee. Let's see if she can pass our Glee Club test. <laughs> Pressure. I'm here with one of the newest members of Glee, Melissa Benoist. How's it going? Good, good. how are you? You like life is good, right? Life is awesome. <laughs> I know you just had a birthday, first of all. I did, yeah. There was like a picture that went out on your Twitter and it mm -hmm. was just kind of like, you were just beaming. <laughs> was it like the little macaroons? Yep. Or was it the Glee or is it the combination? Is it the year you Everything. had? Everything. Yeah. I mean, I don't know how you couldn't be happy with macaroons <laughs> on a plate with a candle. That was the birthday cake? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so this so this whole Glee phenomenon, I know you were a fan of the show before. Yeah. And I saw a great story about how you got the job. They actually told you after the like the last casting. Because mm -hmm. usually you have to wait for the call from the agent. Yes. But they actually told you on the spot. They told me on the spot because I had to start working the following day. So they needed someone that day, Did like you know right that? that moment. We had a, I had a feeling and we knew that like, I was told, you know, because I came from New York City, I was told pack, just pack in case you have to stay for a long time because they really need, like they, they were looking for Marley for yeah. quite a while. Yeah. So it was a kind of a last minute like shuffle. It sounds like one of those reality thing. shows where they're like, pack your bags, you may <laughs> need to leave tonight and you may not. Yeah. So how, so what, what Ryan Murphy came out to you and, mm -hmm. and said something? He walked out of the stage and was like, oh, hi, uh, congratulations, but mum's the word. And my heart like literally stopped, I think, at that moment. <laughs> so were you able to tell anybody at that point? Did you get to, who did, who was the first call? Was my it like, mom. Your mom. <laughs> of course, my mom. She would have killed me if it wasn't her. <laughs> yeah. Since you've been on the show, you got to sing Britney, mm -hmm. Billy Joel, mm -hmm. Adele. Mm -hmm. Any particular favorite? Oh man, how it's do you so pick, hard right? to choose. Cause I, how do you, it's like choosing your favorite child or something. It's true, yeah. yeah. I think my favorite is still New York State of Mind. Your first? Yeah. Yeah. Were you a Billy Joel fan growing up? Oh, so it must yeah. be surreal, you know, having it, not just singing it, but having, you know, the world watch you sing like a rendition of Billy Joel. Such a classic mm -hmm. song. Mm -hmm. And I grew up listening to the song. My sister loves Billy Joel. My dad would listen to it. Like, that's a song that I always loved. And it was an honor to sing it, you know. And so do you watch, are you one of those people you watch it back? Do you have, have you watched My all the performances? Yeah. I'll watch them when we have screenings on set, but I am not a person that likes to watch myself. Really? Yeah. Yeah. I'll like cringe. I'll be like, oh. <laughs> well, everybody else seems to like what, you know, I think you're okay. <laughs> so we have a game for you. Okay. It's called Glee Club or Not. Oh gosh. We are gonna list some celebrities. We're actually gonna show you pictures of celebrities. Mm -hmm. I'll identify the celebrity, you don't have to do that. It'll be pretty obvious. Uh -huh. And we're gonna test your knowledge. Dean Geyer was in here and he played the same game. Did he do well? He I got he nine would've... out of 10. I feel like he was probably jumping around on the couches too. Like he's so, he's so crazy. Yes, he's, he's a, a lot wild. Of energy. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> so we'll say Glee Club or not, whether or not this actor or whoever has released music before. <gasps> okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. There's no pressure at all that Dean got 9 out of 10. <laughs> all right. It's over your shoulder, the pictures. Eddie Murphy is the first one. An album. Or single, just any music at all, Glee Club or not. Yeah. Did he? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> yes. yes. Rob Pattinson. No. Did he? Robert Pattinson has an album? Oh, on the Twilight soundtrack. Oh, like he's singing? He is. I had no idea. He's quite a good singer, too. Oh and my not gosh, bad to I look have at. no clue. Okay, so that's okay. Let's move on. Channing Tatum. I think that's a no, too. Okay. Ding, 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 ding. Russell Crowe. I mean, he's singing on Les Mis. Yes. Ding, 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 ding. Rachel McAdams. Um, I think that's a no. You are correct. Yes. Leighton Meester? Yes. Yes. <laughs> I know that song. Yep. Mila Kunis. Who cares when you look like that? I right? know. She looks amazing. Um, no. Correct. Yeah. <laughs> She's on a <laughs> Scarlett Johansson. She has an album. Correct. 
Oh my gosh, no for two laugh, no pressure whatsoever. Regis, Regis Philbin. Regis Philbin. He does. Yes, that's the one that Dean got wrong. <laughs> he got it right. <laughs> and last but not least, Gwyneth Paltrow. Yes. Nine out of ten. I feel like I need like one extra to like, you know, break the tie. The, the you're gonna have to go back to set and tell him that you tied. He would be him. here in a second. I feel like. <laughs> you could have a feedback. He'd be like, it's on. <laughs> it's totally on. <laughs> well, thank you for coming in. Congratulations on Glee. Thank you. Tiny little show. <laughs> <laughs>